a, a boyfriend is not obligated to provide for the girlfriend. That is a role reserved for the husband. Mm -hmm. And we had put this video online and you know, TikTok is a whole other animal, guys. The comments that followed, what? It's I was not expecting It's it. a community that mm. came. <laughs> there are people who are like, nah. Which is okay. You know, we don't agree. The whole Sprinkle Sprinkle gang came there. And Sprinkles. And they're like, no, this guy is <laughs> not for us. But there's a specific comment that really stood out for me. So this yeah. person came and said, people what's up what's up it's been such a long time doing this you know I... mm. Hi guys. what's up guys karibuni sana to soila and Curtis. it's been a while but clearly. the important thing is that we are here now clearly q2 the hand is still there and this hand is not going still anywhere clapping. this hand is not going anywhere i told you <laughs> We are rising. And it's still clapping. Slowly by slowly. Uh -huh. So what's up? You know, that's another level. Uh -huh. Sasa tumepita level ya what's up. Now we are clapping. You know, that's, that's, that's how we show we are. You <laughs> we know, are that's why even politicians, when they're asking for your vote, wakisha mm. maliza speech, they tell you, tuko pamoja. Anyway. So, <laughs> it's, 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 it, it shows rank. It's, it's a story that will never mm -hmm. finish with Curtis because yeah. that's what he decided. But anyway, guys, we have come across. Mm -hmm a lot of contradicting content online mm -hmm. sometimes i wouldn't say contradicting I would, I, would, I would say interesting okay interesting okay. positively and interesting negatively yeah yeah and and we want to give some of um our thoughts our thoughts yeah. and feedbacks yeah. so uh, you know culture has its own way of just putting out stuff because we all are somehow products of different cultures. Mm. And now we believe in different things at different times. And fortunately or unfortunately, some of those cultures are so deeply embedded in us yeah. that we think that's the truth, nothing but the truth. But the truth. The whole truth. And the whole truth. Yeah. So we just thought to engage culture a bit in, in some of this conversation in and around marriage, relationship and family and some aspects of lifestyle that touch in mm. um, in those areas that we really really have conversation in around yeah. so issues affecting society and yeah. things like that yeah now of course you know you know this by now guys you know i should not be saying this the four magic things mm -hmm. you're supposed to be doing like comment share and subscribe, subscribe. so yeah. it is funny it is funny that around 40% of you who enjoy our content, you've not subscribed. I don't know. What, what do we need to do, Soila? You just keep coming to this restaurant, you eat free food, and then you go. You go away. And I've complained about this so many times. So please like, comment, share, and most importantly, subscribe. And then tell your cousins and your neighbors and your colleagues that there's this couple that you really enjoy and they should come <laughs> check us out. So like, share, comment, subscribe. But we have something special to announce at the end of this video. Mm -hmm. Watch out. Something special. So stick to the end. It's not a very long video. Yeah. So stick to the end. Yeah. And then we have some niceties to let you in on. Mm -hmm. So first reaction. First reaction. Yeah. So show us. Show us, baby. So there's a time I went and uh, posted a video on TikTok. You know, uh, so sometimes we do our speaking engagements. And then we take snippets of the conversation they had in those speaking engagements and then we post it on social. And uh, we posted one uh, in TikTok and it was a conversation about, you know, the different things that men or rather married men should do versus boyfriends. Like if you're dating and if you're married. What are your responsibilities? Yes, are the, the responsibilities the same? same or they are different? Mm -hmm. And in this particular context, we are talking about finances. And I was just discussing how a, a boyfriend is not obligated to provide for the girlfriend that is a role reserved for the husband mm -hmm. now a boyfriend can. can 
provide. Yeah. If, he can spoil the girl, yeah. do things, take her out. You know, he's allowed to do that. But it is not an obligation mm. at this particular point mm. because they are not committed to that extent. Mm -hmm. And we had put this video online and in a TikTok is a whole other animal, guys. The comments that followed. What? It's I was not expecting There's a community that mm. came. <laughs> So, of course, there are those who are like, yes, we agree with this, so bad, nee, nee, nee. but there are people who are like, nah. Which is okay. You know, we don't agree. The whole Sprinkle Sprinkle gang came there. And Sprinkles. And they're like, no, this guy <laughs> is not for us. But there's a specific comment that really stood out for me. So, this yeah. person came and said, in fact, let me just read it. I'll post it there as a screenshot, but let me read it. He said, bro, okay, I can't tell if it's a chick or a dude because I tried to go through the post and it's not clear. But the person said, bro, life has no formula. Kill him, say, afanye what works for him or her, for herself. Now, first of all, that is a self-contradicting statement. statement. Because when you say life has no formula, kill him to afanye what his or works for himself. Whatever works for you, that is your formula. formula. Mm -hmm. And whatever works for me, that is it's my formula. formula. So he's contradicting what he was saying initially, that life has no formula. Uh -huh. But my response to him was that everybody who is successful in their field, whatever field it is, whether it is sports, whether you're an actor, a musician, whatever field it is, anybody who is good at it, everybody who has become successful at it, has figured out a formula to get there. Because success does not happen by accident. Mm -hmm. Success does not, does not happen by luck. There are things you do Compounding to become effects. successful. And marriage and relationships is no different. Anybody who is in a good relationship or in a good marriage, if you ask them, hey, you guys, why have you been... What's you know, the secret? Yes, why have you been this <laughs> long? And you're, It's not a matter of just being together for long. Like, we can actually tell your relationship is healthy. Anybody who is in a healthy relationship or marriage for a long time, or, you know, like you can see the fruits of it, they will tell you there are things we do. Mm -hmm. to ensure that our marriage is this way that is the formula mm. you know and uh, they responded back and they were like well then that means he went back to his you know he changed his argument they were like well then it has a formula but a formula is different for everyone and i'm like well that's not what you said but you know it, it begs another question the bottom line the bottom the bottom line <laughs> the bottom line yeah. is that there is a formula now, sometimes the argument that people bring is, well, your formula might not be the same as my formula. You know. You're right, but you're wrong. Okay? This, this is how I see it. I know we've, not, we've discussed it, but not to that extent. This is how I see it. Okay, let me define a formula first. A formula is an arrangement or a system that you've developed out of principles. Okay? So when we say that our formula for this relationship, it means that there are certain things we've agreed upon based on the principles that we have decided to work in. Now, some people are of the opinion that ah, the principles that you guys work on are not necessarily the principles that work in our relationship. And you know, so sometimes we go to speaking engagements and sometimes when we seem to challenge what some people think, they'll say, okay, well, that's a principle that worked for you. It may not necessarily work for us. Now, let's be honest. I am yet to find, we're talking about marriage and relationships, okay? We're not talking about being a footballer. We're talking about relationships and marriage. I am yet to find a principle that works for one couple but does not work for another couple. I am yet to find. Because last time I checked, principles cut across everyone. Whether you are a couple in Russia or you are a couple in Uganda. Mm -hmm. Whether you are a couple in the days of Moses or you are a couple in 2024. The principles cut across. For example, mm -hmm. one of the principles of marriage, uh, and this applies to relationships, but I, you know, I, I'll mention marriage because that's our context. One of the principles of marriage is forgiveness. Now you cannot tell me at your Curtis, forgiveness just works for you. As we don't have to apply it because it doesn't work for us. Or you cannot tell me, ah, love, love is a principle that just works for you. It doesn't have to work for us. You know? So even this narrative of, oh, uh, your principle, your formula is not my formula. I'm like, okay, in what context are you talking about? Because as far as principles are concerned, 
There is no principle for this couple and principle for this couple. Principles cut across. Now, what is different is the application of the principle. For example, I can say that according to our season, I've realized that according to this season, my wife really wants to be loved through quality time. So I'll spend a lot of quality time with you. Another husband out there will say, okay, according to his season, he's discovered that his wife really is responding to gifts and, and, and service, perhaps. So that's what he will do for his wife. So both of us are, are applying different things, but we are all applying the same principle, which is love. Mm -hmm. Now, the application is different according to the needs of each couple, but the principle is the same. We are all applying love. So when you say that, oh, your formula is not my formula, what exactly are you talking about? Are you talking about the principle or are you talking about the application of the principle? If you are talking about the application of the principle, yes, we can all have different formulas. But if you are talking about the principle itself, there is nothing like, oh, your principle and my principle. The principles cut across everyone. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So oh, I, I didn't go that far in the comments because, you know, Sometimes communications <laughs> and text, mm. and you realize this person you are just going to waste each other's time. You don't you don't debate so much, but we just decided to uh, bring it here because it's something I've heard also of 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 social media. Yeah. I don't know what do you think. You said everything. I didn't say everything. Babe. Of course, you said everything. I, was I didn't say, say everything. <laughs> <laughs> what am I supposed to add? <laughs> you don't have a perspective. No, I uh, think you shared my perspective because we had this conversation off camera so you just said everything uh, formula might be a secret to different people mm -hmm. and it's because them they found out what works for them mm -hmm. you know and they said hey this is working for us and mm -hmm. it's producing this uh fruit. this fruit and yeah. we love the fruit so we'll continue doing it yeah. but for sure the disobeying of a principle mm -hmm. will produce also a contrary fruit that Outcome. is not as pleasant that is not as pleasant. Mm. But we all have formula to doing things. Yes. Every relationship yeah. must have a formula. Even even just mm -hmm. life. Even life itself. in general. Like how you wake up, you have yeah. your tea, what do you do first? You brush your teeth first. Mm. You know, even if you don't have like a system of doing things, yeah. that in itself is a formula. Yeah. Because you will know, oh, I'll have breakfast first, tomorrow I'll brush my teeth first, today I'll make my bed. You know, like you have no... It's basically a routine. You have no, yes. Yeah. It's not so well defined, yeah. but something has to be done. You yeah. still have to go um, through life when the day comes. Mm -hmm. So the same thing with relationship. You have to give of, you have to apply something. Formula, for me probably it will be steps. Steps mm -hmm. to achieving a specific goal. And I think that you see, I knew you had something there. Mm -hmm. You had something there. Please. I think what <laughs> gives a formula, what makes a formula have sense, or what makes a formula make sense, is the goal. Because mm. why do you have a formula? What are you trying to achieve? Mm. So I think as long as you have an end goal or an objective, there is a formula you need to get there. So does that mean if you don't have an end goal or an objective for your relationship, mm -hmm. there's no specific formula that you're going to apply? Remember mathematics even in campus. Mm -hmm. Not campus, man. High school. Like you'd be given marks at every stage of proper application of the formula. Mm -hmm. You might get the answer wrong at the end. Ukochini is equal, equals to something. But the teacher can easily see how you try to apply this specific formula in resolving mm. a mathematical problem. So you might have math number errors here and there, but at least you try to apply the proper formula. They mm. could say, uh huh, you fit the proper formula, but you failed in stage three mm. of applying it. Mm. So I just think it's a steps towards achieving a specific yes. outcome. Yes. And there's something you've mentioned, you've asked. You've asked, what if you don't have that formula? No, a goal. Uh, what if you don't have a goal? Does it mean you don't have a formula? I think that's a good question because we started by saying anybody who is successful in something. So as long as you are looking for fruit or success, there has to be a formula. If you just live life freestyle, you just do relationships freestyle, you never really learn or plan to do or establish certain things, within your relationship or marriage, that's exactly how your relationship will look like. Just, you guys are just there. Is that something like stumbling upon a success? You know, I was thinking about it. I don't think you can stumble upon success. But even if it happens, I don't think it can happen. But let's, let's assume, for the sake of conversation, let's assume you actually 
become successful successful by luck mm -hmm. it is not going to be a long lasting success because the thing about success is that you don't just stumble in it and then you now still you, try. you have to sustain the success isn't mm -hmm. it yeah. you don't just become successful and then now there's no more work yeah. you you work towards success and once you're there you still work towards maintaining the success. If you were a wise person, mm -hmm. you'd now see how do I sustain the success. Exactly. But yeah, guys, um, that was it for this one. Yeah. But life does, life really, um, there is a formula, formula. to achieving, mm -hmm. you know, yeah. the different outcomes that we want in our lives. So you can you can live your life hibi saying that I don't see... I don't need a formula. I don't need a formula. Yeah. But you're following something for sure. Yeah and and it will produce mm -hmm. fruit will be produced expose a seed to different atmospheres it will respond it will respond to according to the atmosphere yeah. expose yourself to different environments mm -hmm. you will respond and produce according to the environment that you are exposed to i, I don't think this is enough like we've, we've met so many of you um in different spaces different platforms different uh different malls in town and we talk about traffic. this very traffic <laughs> like gary gary and then our car is not even tinted yeah. <laughs> so and and for one for those ones that we have time to speak in depth you have said let's have you know can we just have a sit down sometimes and just talk face to face mm -hmm. um about the topics that you guys discuss mm -hmm. and yeah we want to invite you for something that is coming up <laughs> Yes, um, something exciting. <laughs> Karis is so excited, yeah. And we're just calling it E T T C C. Now it's not etc. <laughs> it's not mambo, okay. mambo extra. It could be mambo extra, it literally, could be after yeah. extras mm. beyond the beyond what we are talking here. <laughs> Yeah, but it simply just simply means engaging the culture. Yeah. And as we began the, the this episode, we'll just be engaging the culture on different things that we see popping up, mm -hmm. that's trending, and 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 reasoning with you guys mm -hmm. and with different people mm -hmm. from the basis of the Bible. Yeah, and some of those where those things are concerned. Exactly. So we want to invite you uh, to the first ever. Mm -hmm. ETC, ETC pop up, you mm -hmm. know, that's gonna happen um, on the 18th yeah. of May. Yeah. So, here is the poster yeah. for the details, and also check the website for all other details that mm. you might want to know. Mm. But the first topic of conversation mm -hmm. it's an interesting one. Mm -hmm. So, if you're in relationships mm -hmm. or you're interested in that kind of conversation, mm -hmm. I, I don't think you want to miss this out. Yeah. So, yeah. So check our socials, like she said, our socials, our website for details, and you get to book the ticket on our website. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So the moment you watch this video, it means everything is there. Now I would urge, I would urge, do it as fast as possible because it is it's limited, limited slots. number. Yes. So you'll go book the ticket on the website. You'll get your ticket sent to you, and then you can plan and prepare for mm -hmm. May 18th. It's limited because we're going to have a lot of back and forths mm -hmm. with you as well. You're invited to have this conversation with us live where we'll be um, at. So yeah, see you. Cheers. Bye.